Gail King get up exactly at 324 on the dot every morning? It's funny, I tried to press her like multiple times. I think I still have bedhead. I, I slept in so late. I have no sympathy for somebody that gets to sleep till 630 when I get up at 324. Why do you wake up at 324? Because the segment I like to see comes on at 325. What is 325? What is that segment? What I need to know. Why was she so coy and secretive though? Because it's not on CBS. <laughs> the mighty Gail King with me right now. And Gail, you're home. Billy, we are here. We are back in the studio. You were very, very nervous during the pandemic. You stayed in. Dinner ever out for dinner with friends or anything? Nope. But at least I get to come to the studio and have human interaction. So what are you doing about touching and hugging? This is it. <laughs> Virtual <laughs> pawing, that's it? <laughs> Virtual calling, yes. <laughs> that's that's only going to last so long. On a serious note, you know, a 74-year-old man just went into the hospital for a couple days for precautions, and he came out sending the message that COVID isn't so bad. Don't let it dominate your life. He's posting this. Are you worried about the message that sends? The only thing that I could think of when I watched that was, the, you know, the death toll is 210,000 people who have lost their lives. So I thought about them and I thought about the families that are still grieving. I'm happy that he's recovering and that he looks healthy and he looks strong. You wanna see that in your leadership, but you also want your leadership to understand this is serious stuff and it's not over yet. How did you think Jim Carrey did as, as Joe Biden? With this whole thing? <laughs> did you watch SNL? Yeah, of course. I wondered how are they gonna be able to pull this off with the president of the United States in the hospital? Be funny, be respectful, be poignant, be sharp, and they did all of those things. Gail, the Matrix Awards are on us. You're, you're hosting them virtually. The Matrix Awards celebrates outstanding women leaders. The main reason I'm doing this is because Susan Zarensky, our fearless boss, is one of the honorees this year. For those who don't know, CBS News President Susan Zarensky, the character of Holly Hunter in broadcast news, is modeled after Susan Zarensky. I think we are in such good hands under her leadership. So it's very exciting for us that she's being honored. All right, October 12th at, uh, at noon, the, the Matrix Awards hosted by the legendary Gail King. I'm not feeling legendary, just feeling grateful. There you go. Thank you for watching. If you want more extra, hit the subscribe button and the bell so you'll never miss a video.